I need you, before this match commences, I need you to understand what's going on here. And I need you to understand why you were sitting in this crowd, why you were standing watching me, why you have the privilege of being at this venue. It's because of me. No. It's because of the work, the tireless work ethic that I had, the commitment to this championship to keep this place up. If it wasn't for Mr. Darius Carter, who gets no thanks or appreciation, Hell. if it wasn't for me, there would be no school for you to train at. There would be no opportunities for you to seize. There would be no King of New York. There would be no lethal lottery. There would be no battle bowl. So you're welcome. You look at me, two-time No Limits champion, my second reign being 355 days, I said, 355 days. And now I am a two-time world champion. I've gone through that. He's gone. He's stuck at home with his wife playing video games. Then I beat Dexter. What? And I made the kid look so good he became champion the month after. And then there's Rat Boy Fargo. The man who worked tirelessly years to become number one contender. And then he lost, and then he blew it. Jason Kennedy won one half of the tag team champions and didn't even have the dignity to show up tonight. No. After I took this win, I took the victory. And I should've took his championship too. So please understand the way that Warriors are going to be run in the future. The word era is overused in this business, but I really need you to understand it's a hone in on this fact. I took the championship back from them, I took this company back from them. I gave oxygen to this company. It was on life support under Nest title reign. I took it back and brought you life and gave you opportunities. So I'm not asking, I'm telling. You will respect me. You will respect the Hostile Collective. This is your present. This is your future. This is your life, Mr. Darius Carter.